Well, we are only four days away from one of the biggest games of the year for the birds. And the price tag to see the NFC Championship game in person is pretty big as well. Jasmine Payud is here with the rising cost for tickets. Hey, Jasmine. Jim Janelle, it's a lot of money we're talking about, and this game is on track to be the most expensive conference title game ever. So the question fans have to ask themselves, how much are you willing to pay to see the birds play? Now, tickets went on sale at 10 o'clock on the dot Tuesday morning to see the Eagles play the 49ers Sunday at the link. And getting in line on time was not much help. Ticketmaster's allotment of tickets went rather quickly, leaving only secondary or resale tickets available for purchase. The worst part about this, there was no way to know ahead of time. So people were forced to wait in a queue behind about 2,000 plus people just to get to the end and see only resale tickets left. Fans say there has to be a better way. Everything was pretty much just already resale. There was nothing like face value, which is what I was expecting if you actually got through the queue. Um, so I saw standing room only tickets for like $600. There's got to be a better way to buy tickets. I saw so many comments about, you know, bring back the old Ticketmaster where you had to stand in line at the department store and, you know, just, just wait online to get the tickets. It is what it is kind of to be expected. Uh, gives you a lot of... Uh... A lot of similarities to the uh, the Phillies World Series ticket gamble that went on there. So uh, I mean, it's the hottest ticket on the market right now. So not much you can do about it. Hottest ticket on the market, but this is why everyone's upset. Look at these prices: standing room only, six hundred thirty-five dollars. Upper level, six hundred seventy-three dollars. A lower level, one thousand one hundred dollars. And if you want to be in the club level, you're looking at seventeen hundred dollars. Now these are from StubHub, but according to TickPick, another reseller, the most expensive ticket for this game is only around twelve thousand dollars. Now a reminder: these prices do not include fees, which typically add about ten percent and could add hundreds to the total. And while it's still early, Jim Janelle, it's interesting to see what this means for potential Super Bowl sales. You know, if you want to see the Eagles and Rihanna, how much do you think these tickets are going to go up? A whole lot more money than I have in my, in my bank account. I know that much. All right. Thank you, Jasmine.